Hi folks, welcome to my review. Now I've got something a bit different here for you today. It's going to be a follow up from my previous video on um, my WL Toy Cessna 182, better known as the F949. Now I fitted a Simer battery in here. I think it's 650 milliamps. Um, I mounted it, I'll show you where I mounted it in a, in a short while. Um, I just want to show you, hold on, because it's been raining, you see, so I've had to like hide under cover. I just want to show you that we, it weighs 16 grams, slightly heavier than the 11 gram standard battery. But where I mounted it, it will, um, it, it's in around about the same place, but just higher. But I'll, I will show you, it's, it's in now. But I will show you in a short while what I've done with it. Now this isn't going to be a long flight because this, this will fly for quite a while. So I just want to demonstrate that this does actually work. And there's nothing in this battery bay here. The battery's all at the top. So I'll go for a short flight and just show you how it works. Right, here we go. Bit, bit breezy. Whoop. Let's get it back over here. I'm just going to fly it slow. I'm not going to fly fast either. I just... So it's a slightly heavier battery. It's come down a bit. It's a little bit... A little bit um, top heavy, but... Then again, I've got a slight breeze as well. So... Let's get it closer. Yeah, I know I should be flying near pylons, but... I really wanted to get this video done this is going to be my part two of my battery mod. Now I've got a slight breeze. I'm really fighting it. But it's flying level, sort of. And it's flying on, I'd say about just over quarter throttle. So if it fly on quarter throttle, it's definitely going to fly good on full throttle. Let's get it down. I've got it on low rates as well. Yeah, see how fast it's going one one way. But it's yeah, it's it's, it's handling it quite good. I was finding it better than this earlier on. I was getting it a lot smoother, but we got a bit of a wind. Yeah, see, look, it's hardly moving because of the wind. Yeah, it's stabilising a little bit now. But when I come in in a minute, I'll, uh, I'll show you what I've done. Yeah, see, look, it's quite level considering the weight. Now I was going to counterbalance this with the standard battery in the battery bay but it seems to be doing all right as it is. It's not nose diving or anything so oh, I don't know how long this battery will last probably a good 20 minutes 
but I'm not going to be flying for that. I'm not going to do any loops or anything. It's it's just an experiment, really. I'm just going to fly it nice and smooth. bit more throttle yeah it's doing all right oh lost sight of it then oh let's get it down from now I want you guys to see it really just really just to prove that it works yeah, see that's quite level yeah, that nice little bank turn when you want to turn um, Uh, sort of like at a smaller rate rather than taking a wide arc slow down it will turn a lot quicker if you slow down same as taking a corner in a car the slower you take it the, the less of an arc you create it goes with flying as well yes yeah, flying okay now the winds dropped a bit. I'd say it's flying relatively the same as standard. Now I have seen this mod done but the guy who did it mounted the battery at the bottom of the fuselage. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to see if it works in the top because as you can see it's unintrusive the model still looks like it's standard I haven't got any um, wheels on it because there's no point because it's grass and it would just tear the wheels off so there's no point in that yeah, it's flying alright I'm pleased with this nice little battery mod that lovely lovely flyer Doing all right. I don't know about more power, but it certainly lasts longer than the standard battery, and the standard battery was good. As you know, it's a 500 milliamp, and that will really fly for a long time. I was getting 15 to 20 minutes out of them, but this will fly even longer. So if you include this in your flight pack when you go out, you know, you need the standard one and this one, and it, you know that would give you quite a long, quite a long flight time. Bad for a three-point, four-volt aeroplane, you know, or three? No, sorry, three-point seven in it. Yeah, I'm just bimbling about. You know, I'm only at half throttle. Yes, I don't know what um, quadcopter this battery's out of. It's definitely one of the Sima ones, but if you want this battery, I think it's just—I'll let you know in a minute for sure. But it's uh, a 650 milliamp made by Sima, and it fits perfectly inside the fuselage. Yeah, I'll get a little bit of crosswind here. Yeah. 
that's full throttle against the wind that'll come down a bit I've got pylons right next to me I don't want to end up going in there I'm in a bit of a naughty place to be honest but I chose this place because it's nice and quiet on a Saturday on a Sunday you get a lot of the motocrossers come over here but I know there's no security guards here so uh, and no dog walkers and stuff like that I'm relatively on my own as you can see it's just a safe haven for uh, burnt out cars and stuff <laughs> But, um, whoa, 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 a bit of wind there, look, it's buffering it. Great little aeroplane, I tell you. Great little aeroplane. Really amazing little thing for learning, you know. And for relax, if you're into relaxing flying, then uh, yeah, this is amazing. I'll just fly for a couple more minutes and I'm going to take the wing off and I'm going to show you what I've done. I have done a video already with this mod, but um, in case you haven't seen it, I'll, I'll demonstrate. Whoa, 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 a bit more power, I think. They're yeah, fighting the wind, you see. But you know what, for, for a little aeroplane like this to battle it, it's amazing. It shouldn't really be flying, you know, but... Yeah, let's see, that wind. Oh, I'm not the best flyer in the world. Far from it. I mean, I've flown less less times, and I've got fingers on. on you know, both hands, so, but it's quite easy to pick up, whoa, come on baby, stay up, oh, look at the side wind there, Yeah, 16 gram. Yeah, we're well, just fighting it. Okay, I'm going to come in for a land, folks, and I'll, I'll show you what I've done. Yeah. I've been way too much fun. Shouldn't be allowed at my age. Right, um, uh, get my screwdriver out. Let me poke it somewhere. I'll move it over here because I don't want to lose this little screw that's in there. If I lose it in the grass, I'll never ever find it again. So if I put it over here in the mud, then uh, I'll be able to find it a lot easier. Why is that? Right. Here's what I've done. There you go. Look, I've written 16 on there. 
I've mounted the battery there. The wire is actually long enough to go right back, you know, through. And uh, this is the battery, battery bay. There you go, no battery in there, but look, the wire is plenty long enough. Don't know if you can see that. It's plenty long enough to reach up in there to the Sima battery. Or Sima, whatever, however else, however you pronounce it. And the battery is 3.7, sorry, 600 milliamp. So that's only 100 milliamp more than standard. But it fits see what happens is you've got two little notches there and what you want to do this just about this doesn't rattle about either inside the uh, fuselage but there you go look it pushes neatly in there these little bits there hold it in and it doesn't wobble out and what i do is i pull the wire so it just makes it extra tight you know but there you go that's and you've just seen it fly so all right well i hope you like this video um i'll catch you guys later on bye